Hey y'all, Trapper Bob. We're out at the pond checking traps. I checked this morning, didn't see anything. But it was windy and fucking raining. <coughs> so I figured I'd come back out this evening, go out here, look close to my cable restraints, make sure the wind <coughs> didn't knock them down. So I thought I'd bring you along. I'll show you what I'm dealing with. This here. I've got I've got ten cable restraints through this area. A lot of good trails. Through here. Sorry. Fixing the grass. So far, so good. Oh, I see something bouncing. Oh, we got one down. Now fix this one. Oh, we got we got us a nice coyote over here. Put this one back up. Got knocked down. A lot of deer out here. All right. Let's go get a look at this guy out. Brought the gun with just in case. Yeah. Oh yeah, that's nice. He's a muddy mess, but he's got some good fur. Settle down, buddy. Settle down. Ooh. Look at what we got here. Settle down. You're okay. You're okay. Lay down. Lay down. We just want to get a look at you. Just get a look at you. Beautiful fur. All right, I'm gonna get him taken care of before he decides to get out. So I'll turn you back on. Hey y'all, I'm back. Uh, I got him taken care of. All right. <laughs> right in there, way out there. That's where he was. Probably, um, in reality, 50 yards, maybe 60 at the most. Tall weeds, creek crossing, field here, out at the pond. They got trails all through here. I got, minus that one, I think I've got 13 cable restraints in this area three foot holds up along the timber i just wanted to give you guys a look i haven't showed this spot um it's not my boss's land but i but i do have permission to trap it um the guy that is a caretaker over there he lets me take care um trap this section there's a timber right there I can trap up to the tip tip of this timber and straight across, which gives me this bottom grass. There's a tier, more grass, but it's all cut short. And then another tier, and that's the end of my the land that I can trap. I do have some spots over here along the fence that I just found a couple of real heavy trails that I will put a cable restraint on probably this weekend. As you can tell, it's foggy, it's been raining, and um, supposed to get down just a hair below freezing. Hopefully that takes care of the fog. And uh, yeah, I guess that's about it. I'm gonna run up here and make sure the rest of my cable restraints are working. But that's coyote number nine. 
out here at the pond. So uh, we broke our streak yesterday and hopefully it keeps going. Seems that uh, they're moving back into the area like I was open after deer season. There tends to be a lot of pressure out here. Um, the land on the other side over here that I'm able to trap, um, they manage a pretty good amount and there's only a couple people that can hunt it with the land right behind it, which is the same road that goes up here. There's a bunch of guys that hunt back there and it gets a lot of traffic during deer season. And there's a guy that hunts this. So I don't think he'll be back. He got in trouble for trespassing going over on the land that I got permission to trap. He went over there chasing deer, driving through the fields that he wasn't supposed to be in. Apparently they shot a couple of deer, or he thinks they did. They found two dead does, one shot in the head, one gut shot. So hopefully they get that figured out. Yeah, and the windy too, <laughs> sorry. But uh, yeah, I'm gonna get up here and make sure the rest of the cable restraints are working and get home and get this coyote skinned. Talk to you later, have a great night. Hey y'all, we're back in the trapping shed. I just wanted to show you, he was kind of heavy, so I weighed him. That's what we got. Really nice dark coyote. Thirty-three pounds. I think that's the heaviest one so far this year. It's a big one. It's got really pretty fur. It's dark, but I really like it. So that's the end. <laughs> Hopefully, we keep the streak up and uh, get a couple more tomorrow. I haven't got anything on the home farm yet. Surprised I haven't got at least a raccoon. So, um, that's it. Have a great night.